Deadpool has received a substantial upgrade in Deadpool and Wolverine. And this upgrade is what's going to allow him to stand toe-to-toe -to -toe with Variance and Wolverine himself. When it comes to Marvel Comics, the strongest metal, or one of the strongest metals, depending on who's writing it and what they want to retcon, is of course Adamantium which is what Wolverine's skeleton is made out of, and specifically his claws, which we see so frequently. So recently we found out that when Deadpool is taken by the TVA, they of course don't have time to make him grab everything that he has. Hence why they're going to give him a new suit, but also what happens with his, well, arsenal. Well, they got to give him a whole lot of weapons, and what we learned from reports is that he's given a pair of new swords, but these swords will be made out of adamantium. And it's because they realize that he's going to have to go toe-to-toe -to -toe with Wolverine, and if he does, Wolverine is absolutely going to shred through his normal swords. So, he gets adamantium once because adamantium stops adamantium. So now we know exactly what's going on with those set photos and videos and people's complaints. Now, I think this was just kind of a natural course for this to go. Because the moment we saw the set video, everybody said, oh, he's got adamantium swords, right? Like, we all kind of figured the same thing, considering we've seen Wolverine's claws shred through metal, shred through swords, and various other things. It makes sense that if... Deadpool is going to go face to face with him yeah if he's clashing swords with Wolverine's claws and they're not breaking this obviously means that he has adamantium or one of the other metals out there that his swords are made out of so kind of cool right kind of expected but now I guess we got the confirmation so there it is um pretty awesome I mean I don't think there's anything else to say about it right it's like yeah we expected it we're gonna get it sweet thumbs up